Welcome back to our channel, Kentucky Pride Fun. Today, I am doing a fall tablescape challenge. Don't leave me here forever. Don't let me be alone. Just see you and me together. This fall decor tablescape challenge is hosted by Kenya at Kenya's Decor Corner as well as Kimberly Davis with Diva Designing on a Dime. I'll be sure to leave the link to the playlist down below so that after watching my video, you can go check out all of the other wonderful creators and their lovely fall tablescapes. If you are coming over from the challenge, welcome. I hope y'all will enjoy my video, and if you do, be sure to leave it a thumbs up. I also, besides doing decorating and especially fall decor, I also love to keep a clean house as well as a clutter-free house as much as possible, and I'm working on going through our house and decluttering. If I also love to do shopping hauls, especially during the seasonal times. So if y'all love any of that type of thing, other lifestyle type videos, definitely be sure to go check out my channel and consider subscribing. Let's decorate! I start off by using my Mrs. Myers multi-purpose spray in one of their fall scents, the Mum scent. You can go watch my haul on all of my Grove Collaborative stuff that I got. I'll have that linked up in the cards as well as down in the description. And I'm just using this to go ahead and give the table a good wipe down as well as the backs of the chairs. This is my plaid tablecloth that I'll be using. I always like to set it out for the fall season. Now that I have the tablecloth set up, I'm going to be wiping it down again using that same spray and just to make sure I get all the crumbs and dust since it has been stored up since last fall. And I'm also going to try and be getting the little wrinkles out from being folded up. I'm just going to be using the same little basket that I found at a thrift store once in our napkin holder. I dusted both. Here are my two little pumpkin salt and pepper shakers. I'm just refilling, adding some more napkins. And then here are my little um, pot holders. My three little pumpkins that I have, I've collected over the last couple years. And now I'm going to work on my DIY for my little floral piece. Here I am just using a little box that actually held tea bags. And I was originally going to use some ribbon to put on it. I still might, I don't know. Um, and then I'm also going to be using those flowers that I have left over from my lantern centerpiece that I did. Here are some close-ups of how everything turned out. My three pumpkin pot holders. I seem to have the theme of pumpkins going. And then over here, you'll see my Mrs. Myers candle that I have in the geranium scent. I thought it went well on the table. And then over here, I have my toothpicks in the little canister there that I found once at a Goodwill. I thought that was super cute. And my two little salt and pepper shakers that are pumpkins. And then on the back side, I did my little DIY. I didn't add the ribbon. Comment down below whether you think I should add it or not. But here are the flowers. I have the same ones in my lantern centerpiece, so I thought it was a nice tie-in to kind of combine it all together. I like it how it's nice and simple. If y'all liked my fall tablescape, give it a thumbs up. If you are new, be sure to click that red subscribe button as well as the little bell so that you don't miss out on any more of my videos. Thank y'all for watching. Bye!